Hello, this is Mouse Guy, and today I'm going to be reviewing The Lone Ranger. There's John Reed, aka The Lone Ranger, played by Army Hammer, and he did a good job playing him, because he seems like the classic cowboy. And he could actually be pretty funny in the movie, so he's one of the best characters, which is a good thing since he's the title character. There's Tonto, played by Johnny Depp, and he's probably my favorite character of the entire movie, because he's really funny and he makes a good sidekick. And some of his philosophies on life and stuff are like sometimes so weird and crazy that you actually believe they're true. And while he may remind you a little bit about Jack Sparrow, for the most part, he doesn't remind me of him too much. And for those who think it's racist, just go enjoy the movie. There's Rebecca Reed, the Lone Ranger's sister, um, and she's a good damsel in distress, I guess, but you won't remember her the most from the movie, but she's okay. There's also the villain Butch Cavendish, who is very menacing, I thought. One reason because of that is he's a cannibal. He even eats someone's heart in the movie. That's right. He eats someone's heart. But don't worry, it's off screen. There's Red Harrington, the owner of some dance like club place, but she's cool because she has a peg leg and it's actually a gun. There's Latham Cole, a railroad tycoon who wants to make a lot of money off of the railroad, and let's just say he's suspicious. The action scenes in this movie are really awesome, and they make you feel like you're watching an old western movie or something. All the camera shots and special effects in this movie are really good too, and it really sets the mood, I think. So most likely, one of your favorite things about the movie, and maybe the most memorable thing, will probably be the action scenes. However, the movie isn't perfect. There's some p ways that they told the story I didn't really like. Because, I mean, it's sort of actually told as a story from a character, which is actually old Tonto. And also, some characters aren't as well developed as others. And there are some similarities to Pirates of the Caribbean, but it definitely doesn't deserve all the hate from critics. At least I don't think so. I found it to be very enjoyable and funny, so I give it an 8 out of 10. See you later. By the way, doesn't that look like bird poop?